Blackmagic, I think, is trying to steal some market share away from Adobe, and I'll tell you why. With DaVinci Resolve 20.2, you can now import ARW codec files in your DaVinci Resolve project. So I'm gonna try this for the very first time right now. Bro, it worked. It worked. Let's, I'm gonna drag this down here. Sweet. Okay, so DaVinci Resolve is definitely coming after the photography market just because there are so many uh, video creators that also do photo, myself being one of them. This is so cool because they're finally letting us edit actual photos here. Oh, yes, yes, Blackmagic, you're finally getting it. ARW support in a video editor, that, that's cool. That's cool. Especially with how robust the color grading suite of tools is in DaVinci Resolve. If Premiere's color editing, their Lumetri system, or maybe even Avid's was, or Final Cut or whatever, if their stuff was a little bit better in terms of their color grading tools, I don't think this would be like as big a news as I believe it is, but it's not. DaVinci Resolve is the go-to color grading tool. It is the finishing tool for color. And now you can do this. Like you don't need to have a Lightroom subscription, Adobe subscription anymore if you're a Sony photography shooter. And I'm sure the Canon codecs are coming soon. I'm sure that's probably some deal that they have to get with Canon or maybe uh, Lumix and Nikon, all those other camera companies as well. But this is a start and this is a very promising start. So I'm very, very, very happy that these changes got, that they finally got implemented